Hey everyone, it's Mike and Becca here from My Travel BF, and if you've been following us on social media at all, you know we're here to make a huge announcement. So as you all know, uh, we have been living here in Madrid for the past 11 months, um, teaching English through a program with the Spanish government. It is a great program to be able to live and work in Spain. However, it's not really a long-term solution for anyone, nor was it ever a long-term solution for us because we both have experience as licensed professionals in the US, myself as an ESL teacher, and Becca as a school social worker. So our goal in moving to Europe and doing this program was so that we would gain experience working at different schools and also try to get our foot in the door somewhere here in Europe. Um, now that said, we did find jobs at an international school for the next school year, so we are going to be moving to Germany. <laughs> and we are really excited about it. Um, so Mike is going to be an ESL teacher and I'm going to be a school counselor. And we, um, you know, as much as we love Madrid and have loved living in Spain, um, we're really excited to be doing what we, what we want to be doing in our life. And so. what we're trained to be doing and have experience doing instead of being language assistance in the classroom. In about two weeks, we're actually gonna be leaving Madrid mm -hmm. um, and moving to Germany. We're gonna be driving there with Churro. Mm -hmm. So that'll be a little bit of an adventure, but we are sad, as Becca said, to be leaving Spain. Our goal was to find a job here. However, we weren't able to. Mm -hmm. um, but in saying that, we are thrilled to be going to Germany. We found a job at a great, what seems like a great school there. And we're both really excited to start there, although learning German is going to take a little bit because we don't really speak any German. And even though Germany may not have been our first choice, um, we are really excited to be trying something new and exploring a new part of Europe and, um, you know, keep our little adventure going. Yeah, so while the language will be different, the culture will be different, I feel like we, we really immersed ourselves in the Spanish language and culture here mm -hmm. and have both improved our Spanish and learned a lot about the culture through local experiences and meeting people. Germany is going to be kind of a whole other animal to tackle because, I don't know, I suppose it's a little bit more difficult not speaking the language. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll hopefully be taking some German classes, learning German, as well as being able to explore a whole other part of Europe, as Becca said. We've been to Germany separately, mm -hmm. but just for a few days visiting a couple cities at a time. So we've never really been there for sort of long, slow travel at all. So we're really excited to be there. Um, we'll actually be there for the next two years. Mm -hmm. um, and then we will see what goes from there. Yep. So make sure to follow us along on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, um, so you can kind of see our journey and you know our life there and getting set up in our, in our new schools. Yeah, we'll definitely be doing more videos about culture shocks we have there, exploring places there, um, just what it's like living in Germany as well as moving to a different country while being in a different country to begin with. And also, if you have any tips, tricks, um, advice, anything about German or Germany or moving to a different country when you're already in a different country, <laughs> please let us know, share those with us. It's the first time for us, so we're always happy to learn from other people who are more experts than we are. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, we hope to become experts in Germany and learn a lot about the country and culture, but we don't really know anything right now. So please share those with us. Um, if you're in Germany or you've been there before, we'd love some local tips, local experiences, so we can check those out when we're there. Mm -hmm. So as Becca said, follow us on social media and make sure to stay tuned. And while you're here, make sure to check out our other videos about what it's like living abroad as American as well as traveling around Europe and the world and a bunch of local experiences that we've had, so you can have those too. We'll see you over at our other videos. Bye.